Hi everyone, in this video we will create a PDF viewer in React.js So I have created, I have created this program So right now we have an um, input field which takes a file and also then a button which will use for reviewing the PDF So this area that you see in a grey color it is uh, specified for viewing the PDF here and right now we don't have any PDF file so it's as written here that no PDF so let's import a PDF now okay it is a PDF file with us view PDF so it has loaded okay guys so today we will create this example okay using react.js so let's get started guys uh, we need three packages to install them for viewing pdf okay so first we will come to this react pdf viewer this website then to the documentation so here we will come first we will install this package okay first we will sign mjs this package okay i have i will list the packages in the description so you can find the links there so first we will install this package and the second package with us is this package okay this core pdf viewer okay it is the second package and the third package is we will install this uh, plugin okay react pdf viewer default layout okay we will install this you have the link for this in the description you can install using npm it also so now let's start our program how to create this so let's get started rfc and export it also so i will come here it is the container with me and also i will import the bootstrap because i'm using bootstrap this is and bootstrap.main.css and here I will create an input field okay I will create a forum and in the forum we will have an input field and the type will be file and also the class name will be class name with us is forum control and also I will create a button which is used for view pdf and class name button button success and also type will be submit so i have created this our form so down so here i will just write h2 here view pdf so let's run our server local server okay npm start so it will start the server and by default it will run the browser so let's see it see it we have this file and also the button i will specify an area for the pdf and i will assign a class name for this pdf container and so for this container i have written the code in this pdf viewer css file okay pdf container this code is for that container and I will just import that CSS file import that slash fedf viewer.css so now whenever we change this input field and also when we click this button submit button so for that uh, first uh, we should have two state the first state is that const pdf file with us whenever we change this input field set pdf file okay and is equal to we will use use state hook and the second one will be const view pdf set 
view PDF you still put by default both will be null with us same to that this one okay so now whenever we click on this input field and we change it we will apply unchange event on it unchange handle unchange okay let me just give one name change now we will implement this function const handle change is equal to an event will come to this here here now we will um, write event we will assign that the pdf file to select it file is equal to e event dot target dot files zero okay the file will be assigned to the selected um, variable then f selected file if the file was existed so then first we will specify the extension of the pdf so for that we will write file type is equal to application slash pdf okay so for that now we will write f selected file and it means if it was true both and then the file type that includes selected file selected file dot type if the type type was the same it will come to the if uh, to this body this lack of code so then here we here we will create a new um, a reader now let reader is equal to new file reader so we have created a new reader now now reader dot read as data url selected file and also reader dot unload another function will get it now we will set our pdf file set pdf file e dot target dot result so we have set our set a pdf file we are send a value to that so now if the extension was not pdf so then else set pdf file to null and also you can create another state for error so here you will show an error that the file extension is not pdf so now if uh, there was no pdf file you can also assign an error like you will write here if the pdf file was not selected then uh, console.log please select you can write the an error okay so we handled our change a function and we completed our code for this function so now whenever we click this submit button so we should call and change here also and change event handle submit okay we will create that function also const handle submit Event dot prevent default prevent the default loading and also now if PDF file was not equal to equal to null so then what it should do it should set set to view PDF to the PDF file else set to view PDF null 
so this pdf file and also set view is a state for us this is also a variable let me show that to you this pdf file and set view pdf so we use these two states so now we will write our code for the pdf weaving okay for this area for the pdf container so for that first i will import the packages which i have installed already i will import those come here and just import them paste them here i have imported them these are for the CSS. that is for plugin layout and that is the code library or package and these two will be used for viewing the pdf so now we will come here and write our code here so for viewing the pdf i will copy this code okay first of all the worker and the worker use a, a property Um, it will use this link and also the view pdf if the view pdf was existed so then it will use the viewer then we will use that uh, variable which we has created the state that file it will read that file and it will use this plugin okay this plugin which i have created uh, here okay this plugin okay we have created and imported that from um, the plugin we imported that here uh, and also if the pdf was not existed then it will like no pdf okay so let's see how it looks like so right now we have this area and let's select a file not selected the submit button the submit button here oh sorry we should write here we should write here unsubmit unsubmit we should call the submit function let's refresh it and let's import a pdf file let's view pdf so see it we have loaded our pdf file okay see it you can just use this size okay and also the pages there are two pages first and second you can search and also a download print and these are the options in this pdf viewer so it was all about weaving a pdf using react js so if you have liked the video please subscribe to our youtube channel uh, and thanks for watching